In a diversification of tourism promotion in Kenya, the Kenya Wildlife Service, in collaboration with Wasin Gishu County Government, plans to stock Chebora Rural Wildlife Conservancy with the Habivorous Game Reserve. The conservancy will be located along the common border of Wasin Gishu and Elgeo Maraquet counties. The setting up of the sanctuary is expected to boost conservation efforts as well as open up the region to local and foreign tourists. Tourist camps and lodges in such conservancies provide employment which requires training, eventually resulting in transfer of technology within the community. Pastoralists are now undergoing formal training on new concepts of preserving land aimed at avoiding turning grazing lands into deserts through overgrazing. Funds generated from tourism activities would be invested back into the local community by means of hospitals, mobile clinics, water projects, beekeeping and setting up of workshops to make handmade beads and basket work which in turn can be sold to tourists visiting the area. In a statement, KWS Warden in charge of Wasin Gishu and Nandi County's Joel Kanda says, and I quote, we are at an advanced stage to develop Cheboraroa Wildlife Conservancy, which will be the first of its kind in Kenya. We are soon starting public barrages to engage local residents and other stakeholders. End of quote. The sanctuary comes several weeks after formation of the North Rift Economic Block, where eight North Rift counties pledged to collaborate to exploit viable opportunities in the region. Kanda says that once the sanctuary is fully developed, investors would develop hospitality facilities and youth would benefit from jobs created. Kanda noted, and I quote, learning institutions within the catchment region will save resources by touring this sanctuary instead of traveling long distances to Masai Mara. We foresee an influx of tourists in the northern Kenya counties, which now exist as one economic and tourism block. End of quote. Carol Jenga for Business Defined.